Hey guys, I'm gonna keep it back here for another video, guys, and welcome to a Fortnite challenge video. Guys, if you want to see more of these Fortnite challenge videos, make sure to like and subscribe button. Also, comment down below a challenge you would like to see me do next. Now, guys, this challenge is quite an interesting one. So, pretty much the whole idea of this is I have to tear down this whole entire building right here so I can get enough wood to rebuild the building next to me out of complete resources. Meaning I'm going to recreate this home, this house, out of my own resources, all made out of wood. So this was quite a journey. Now, you're going to see this first attempt I do, I actually end up failing. And the main reason why is just because someone ends up coming up on me, which this is not the easiest thing to do, falling on the fact of how loud it actually is. Can you imagine being in a Fortnite game, you know, trying to gain resources, trying to move from one path to the other, and someone is destroying a whole entire house? Now, the surprising thing, and kind of funny thing at the same time, is that I am in a remote, you know, destination. I am a far away from the center, from the circle, and any kind of concept. So the fact that someone would be out this far, which I purposely went this far for that reason, was actually quite amazing. So, as you're going to see right here, this is the concept, and I have to go ahead and recreate the house next to me. Now, because I don't, I'm not able to, you know, memorize every inch of the house and next to me, I'm just going to go ahead and replace every wall for every wall I destroy. So, therefore, you know, if I destroy a wall, I will place a wall there um, back and forth. Now, the only issue with what I did here, though, was I took way too much time. You don't have much time when it comes to doing this process, obviously, because of the fact that the storm is coming in eventually. So, I had to go ahead and, you know, walk without much time to walk with. So, starting off right away, we're going to start off with the roof. Now, as you can see right here, as I destroy it, I have to go ahead and rebuild it. So, I had to rebuild the walls. Now, I can't rebuild it perfectly because I cannot do... I. Actually, I could I could actually do a, tri a pyramid roof, but I kind of forgot to. I took an L in that aspect, but it's close enough. You know, I'm going to build walls around the whole entire roof as I destroy it. So, you see right here, if you're inside of the building, it looks exactly the same as if when I found it. Um, I should have kept the fireplace here, but I decided to destroy that just for some extra resources. Again, this whole entire process does cost a lot of resources. Now, I just imagine, you know, whoever is near me, as I, for I actually took an L there too, I, I should have put stairs right there instead of putting a wall up there. But, um, as I was saying though, you know, anyone who's running past me probably just had no idea what I was doing. I mean, can you imagine someone, you know, literally building as I, you know, I, I fix it right here. But can you imagine someone, you know, destroying a house and rebuilding it? Now, I first got this idea was when I was actually going by the depot in a squads game. And what happened was someone completely destroyed the depot. And my whole concept was, well, what if someone rebuilt the depot? What if someone, you know, after destroying the whole entire thing, just went ahead and rebuilt it? What would it look like? Would it be cool? Would it be fun to watch? I don't know. So I decided, let's go ahead and try that, you know, whole thing out. Now, again, this first house, uh, you're going to see right here, I end up getting attacked sometime soon because someone decides to shoot down my wall. Like, come on, man. I'm trying to build a beautiful house here, and someone decides to be a, you know, not the nicest person and decides to come try to kill me. Which I'm, again, still surprised the fact I am so far away from them. Why they even attacked me was kind of, you know, just crazy. Now, I ended up dying here because I wasn't focused on actually, you know, fighting someone. I was focused on building a house. So, I wasn't really, you know, all there when it comes to, like, in the process of thinking I was going to get jumped. So, let's go ahead and go to take two. Now, take two, same concept as take one. I'm just trying to go ahead and build this as fast as possible. Now, the issue with, you know, landing in a area that's far away from you know where the bus is is just the fact that it does take time to get there so by the time you get there you know the storm the count the uh, countdown timer is already going now this time I did grab some more weapons 
just in case I do go ahead and get jumped. Because I believe Snobby Stores is right to my left here. So in case I do get jumped, I wanted to have some kind of weapon to defend myself. So with that in mind, as you see, I'm just destroying this house. And then we go ahead and go to the next house and slowly rebuild it. Now, again, guys, give some ideas down below what I should do next. But, I mean, I think, honestly, this is probably one of the craziest ideas I have thought of in a long time when it comes to Fortnite. I mean, there's so many different things you can do with Fortnite, which is, you know, the best thing about Fortnite is it's all about building. You know, it's all about you, you personalizing everything yourself. And again, I should not have wasted this time getting weapons. I only did it just in case I got attacked. And it was just a complete waste of time. It was not worth it in any kind of concept. But right here, I ended up breaking into the roof. And again, just like the other build, I'm going to go ahead and build the roof back to what it was. And I'm going to go ahead and just put, which I should have put, um, you know, pyramids right there. But I'm just going to go ahead and do it like this. So again, slowly but surely... As long as no one comes in and attacks us and tries to kill us, we should be able to rebuild this whole entire roof pretty nicely. Now, I probably should use the pyramid stairs in order to, you know, rebuild this. Um, now, if you guys do, are new to, you know, like the strategy of the pyramid stairs, pretty much what the strategy is is you go ahead and edit a pyramid. You take out two of the uh, uh, two of the sides, and they become stairs. And you can use them just like regular stairs. That's the whole concept behind that, and it actually works pretty well. So I probably should have used that instead, but I decided not to. So starting off right away, you're gonna see we got the roof done, and that honestly is probably the most difficult part. You have to go ahead and you know slowly but surely get there, and it's not easy to do that. Now I cannot make windows. I believe I can make windows, but I actually forgot to. Uh, you know, all you have to do is edit it, and then you know to make a window. I forgot to do that. I did go ahead and make the doors for each and every one of these houses just because I wanted to. It was, it's pretty funny, but I should have made a window. All you have to do is edit one panel. Panel and you can make yourself a window for these houses now again not much time to work with I was just you know trying to get this done as fast as humanly possible you see I only have 25 seconds left to build this whole entire house and personally speaking I probably could never actually get this done realistically now you're gonna see in this video I do not end up getting this done because realistically I don't think you can it's um you know the time it takes to go ahead and land you know go destroy one house get to the next house and do that is just realistically way too much time and you're never going to be able to you know get this done so i got close enough i feel like i got majority of the house almost until you know the side uh like the um what's it called the garage area but the only issue was i was not able to get the garage in any kind of concept because of the fact you know it took way too long and again i was looting a little bit which was just stupid it took some time but after that first you know person killing me i was like okay let me get a weapon just in case i do get jumped but this time luckily no one decided to go ahead and jump me so that's going to be my, you know, I guess attempt, which isn't really attempt. I did, I believe, a pretty good job at this. I definitely recreated this house, except for, you know, the garage. I pretty much recreated this whole entire house. And, of course, I did miss one wall right up there. But I think I make up for it by creating this uh, garage area right here. So I did, you know, do some of the garage, but I didn't do the um, roof of the garage. So, again, pretty good job. Tell me down below what you guys think. I thought I did a pretty good job. I was pretty proud of myself doing this, which, again, is just a crazy thing to do. I wasn't even focused on trying to go to the storm I and mean, get through the circle. But, guys, this is going to be what it looks like. I recreated the house in Fortnite made out of materials. Again, I wish I used pyramids and on the roofs instead of that. That would have looked so beautiful. But... Guys, tell me down below what you guys think. Should I go ahead and redo this with uh, brick? Should I try it again with brick? Should I try to finish this? Tell me down below what you guys think. And again, give me some ideas on what I should do next when it comes to this series. Now, I tried to go ahead and go up there. And I learned you cannot... Um, well, sorry. I do not believe you can build. For some reason, I could not build right here. Which was actually kind of interesting. I do have resources. But for some reason, I could not build. I think it's because it was actually... Uh, the chest was blocking it, I believe. So I could not build there, which was kind of upsetting. I wanted to go ahead and finish this up, but I could not because I didn't. I think the chest was blocking the um, area. 
So again, tell me down below, guys, what should I do next? And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.